friends what's up what's up my people welcome and welcome back to our channel mo and mpai mwal eh? it's your girl mpai here and today i'm i'm in the kitchen i want to show you another recipe so thank you so much by the way for your support you've been so amazing to us eh? we appreciate so today i want to show you how i prepare tamarind sauce Nyote mnajua tamarind sauce ni nini? Ukwaju ile yenye watu wanatumia kukulia nayo viazi karai and what a view. Bajia hizo. So this is the tamarind itself. I've soaked it in in a in some water. I've washed it then soaked it in some water. Here I have onions, chilies, one carrot, three cloves of garlic, one piece of ginger and powder chilies also we have some salt to taste so we want to start by cutting this chopping all these ingredients so this is how we prepare tamarind sauce required kuna so many styles and designs za ku recipe za ukwaju za kutengeneza ukwaju but today i'm going to show you one of the ways eh? one of the methods either way you will achieve your tamarind sauce so in most cases this carrot is boiled kuna design nyingine kitaka you can boil it but as for today i'm not going to boil it it helps in thickening the the tamarind sauce and also to somehow sweeten you know the tamarind tastes sour or is it sour or bitter sour so it's gravy in taste in order to neutralize it some people add some a spoon a teaspoon of sugar but as for me i will use a carrot you all know that carrot is sweet eh? oh i forgot to chop this remember to wash them to wash everything even your hands wash your hands before touching your food So let's do this. Hebu muniambie hapo chini kwa comment. Mshawahi kula ukwaju? Ama hii ndo mara ya kwanza nitakuonyesha. <laughs> muniambie hapo. Ama tell me your experience, your experience after kuonja ukwaju siku moja. Ulisikia aje? So you see here I have a this is called a mot a pesto. Hey, I don't know which one is which, eh? but I know if it's full and complete, it's called a mortar and a pesto. This one is a pesto. This one is a mortar. Yeah. So it's its work is to grind these ingredients. Yeah. So we can put the garlic and the ginger into the mortar and the pesto. So let me give you a, a hint, a secret. What is it called? A kitchen hack. Eh? If you want to uh, garlic and ginger to to go the karaka, you use salt. So we're going to grind these together to make a thick paste. I like thick. <laughs> Even a garlic and ginger paste, I call it thick. Hmm? So just to make the ginger and garlic paste, you see how it tastes like. And in a bondeka raka, and like when usipo add salt, uta ina kusumbo, uta pata ingine ina ruka uko, ingine ina ruka na uko. So, after the ginger at least now we can add the pepper pepper 
de pepeo nataka ku add hiyo nini after hizo zingine zishapondeka kwa zinaweza kurukia kwa macho you have to be very careful the other way <laughs> if not the paper will get into your eyes and you'll you'll start crying guys eh? i remember there is a day when i was young my mom was grinding like this and then i just went and put my face like this why i crawled i crawled <laughs> i crawled tears of crocodile <laughs> By the way, I cried. I cried. That thing. I want to show you. And I like using the red chilies in my ukwaj, in my tamarind sauce. Eh? But you can use the green one. Uh, whatever color. But the, the red one makes it more appealing. You just ensure that it may bondeka vizuri or I want to show you another way but we'll just continue so I have this what is it called uh blender that the three in one blender so there is this side I want to break it to break the carrot since we can't grind it using the mortar pestle in some cases, you can put all your ingredients in this thing. Even the garlic and what have you. But Mimi, I like my garlic grinded by the mortar and pestle because haito baki baki na tuvitu. So, we're going to grind this. It's on. This one you don't add. Hey, hey, hey! You want me to story? Blend I hang. Hey, I make a. I can't make a car manga happy. Is it? Hey, since 2017. Imagine. Can you count for me? Now we are. 2024. So 2018, 2019, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Imagine seven good years using this blender. So I just want to see if they are all grinded or not. I think they are not finely grinded. So I repeat the process until it's equal to Imabondeka Mzuri. Finally, just a bit so that so I was telling you, you may to blend up on your cassava sasa. But I may boy can nice, you need pean and in a doing guinea, but you get up to me, but you had to come. I in a tiny self, Muda water. So, mnaziona venye ziko, zimebondeka tu vizuri. Na hii pia inaweza kutumia kama tu salad. Unaweza chukua hii kitu, uweke kwa kibakuli in a bowl or a plate, then you add some lemon. Alafu uitumie tu kama you are na some chilies, then you use it as a daily salad. Na kuanga pia tamu sana. So, mimi kwa jangu by the way napenda pilipili. Apart from the red and green peppers I've used, I'll also use the pure ground chilies eh? in yiku powdered. Pia nita add up a significant amount. And I'll 
grind and grind until it mixes well with the other chilies and the other ingredients. So here we have our ingredients grinded and finely. You see, we want to mix it in a bowl. Uh -huh. You see, here is our tamarind, the one which we had soaked. So I have washed my hands, ensure that your hands are clean or use the kitchen gloves if you have them. Because you need clean hands. Kufurujua ukwaju. <laughs> Sometimes so the name ya kufanya kufurujua ukwaju watu na tukiona mwanaume anafanya hivyo tunaambia wewe acha kufurujua ukwaju <laughs> So tuli nickname hivyo huko <laughs> nyumbani Mhm mm so unas, unaiona vile imekuwa thick the seeds zina nini zinajitenga na nini hiyo zina form paste Ha Mati ya nanitoka. Kama unajua utamuwa hii, najua tu lazima sa hii. Mati ya nakutoka, unatamani. So unatoa the seeds. You remove the seeds from the paste. From the sauce, I mean. Ina nimezoya paste. Sauce and paste. And dough. So, kama ukuna ya doubt kama kuna tu vitu vitu utapata hapo ndani like hii ukwaju mnajua ile cover yake ya juu huwa bado vitu zake zinabaki hapo time ya kutoa so unaweza use a sieve but mimi naona ki sieve huwa itabaki too light unaondoa tu zile vitu zenu utaziona zimetoka i want to wash my hands first hands now they have unaona you see this is our tamarind paste. We want to mix it with all these other ingredients that we grind. Is it ground or grinded? That we grinded or we ground. Eh? Whatever, man. English is not my mouth. So you need a ginger, garlic and chilies you see now we have the carrots and onion we want to mix all these things together all of them and then here comes the Magic. Tunaona zile vitu za chini zinabaki huko. Hizo uchafu chafu kama unataka unaweza sieve but either way unaona tu una achieve the same. Remember we had we had added some salt during grinding the what? Garlic and ginger. So we'll just have to test to see if it had mixed well with the tamarind sauce or we need to add. So here we are adding our salt. You see, now here is the here is what we call tamarind sauce. You can make it thick like this or you can add some more water and for it to be not to be thick. So guys, this is it for today and you can serve this with viazi karai, bajia and looks so yummy yummy and it tastes so it's gravy <laughs>
ukwaju uwa uko ngwadu si tamu sio kali but ni ngwadu so we're going to serve with our bajias there you can see bajias za dengu yeah so let's take a bite so that we can test our ukwaju how our ukwaju tastes on our bajia <coughs> Even the water nafanya lazima utoboe ka kishimo. Ukwaju mtamu. Ukwaju mtamu sana. Guys, you can try this recipe and let me know what you think about it. So guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Kindly subscribe if you have watched and you are, you are not yet my subscriber. Like this video comment and share it with your friends until next time ciao